<clears throat> Shalom. First and foremost, I'm going to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, where conquer dust. The belongs to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone who will grow. <clears throat> Peace and salutations to the hopeful elect, 144,000. And the one third men, women, and children who are watching, listening, learning in that order. This is Shamaria Allen with the Great Millstone chapter out of Milwaukee, Wisconsin. And uh, right back at you. Um, this is actually uh, a video that uh, Elder Malcolm out of uh, GMS Chicago posted earlier um, today. And uh, one of the things he had mentioned on here that, you know, they might end up taking it off. So I thought, you know, hey, why not keep the party going? <laughs> And um, reposted it and uh, adding um, a little bit of commentary and some scriptures along with it. But uh, for the most part, um, it was edifying. And hey, all I can do is be like what they say unto a, a, a mockingbird and just can, to repeat what's been said. But um, I'm going to play this video and I'm going to grasp the scriptures. Esau committed five sins in a single day. He dishonored a betrothed maiden. He committed a murder. He denied. And so a betrothed maiden basically is a virgin, a young woman. All right. He defiled her. So he went. In, so a woman was promised to a, another man. He went on into someone who was engaged. That's adultery. And a sin worthy of death. Gods. He denied the resurrection of the dead. And he spurned his birthright. Unquote. Moreover, our tradition tells us that the Edomites are the ancestors of the Romans, Whoa. and indeed of all Europeans and the entire Christian world. Whoa! <laughs> Wasn't my words, man. Now, I wonder if, if Google's little team is going to, you know, come and delete. They may delete my video, but they'll leave his up. Maybe. That's some pretty uh, damning uh, uh, evidence. But with that, I'm going to give all praises to and honor unto you. How about you Okay, so there you have it. You have uh, the so-called Jew rabbi who is an Edomite and uh, more likely from the bloodline of Amalek who is a um, leading tribe of the so-called Edomites, the grandson of um, Esau Edom. And um, what we have here We have an Edomite nation that's divided amongst themselves. And as the scripture says in Mark 3, verse 25, it says, And if a house be divided against itself, that house cannot stand. So what we are witnessing is uh, Bible prophecy happening before us. And uh, Esau's kingdom is uh, on its way of being kaput, as the, the Germans say. Or shut down, <laughs> and um, the new the new reign of leadership is going to come from Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Shai all the way down through the the hopeful elect and the children of Israel. Um, this is Second Thessalonians verse two verse chapter two verse three Salakia, and it reads. Let no man deceive you by any means, for that day shall not come except there come a falling away first, and that man of sin be revealed, the son of perdition. And so right now what, what you have, uh, that what is happening right now is Esau Edom is being revealed, you know? And it's, uh, it's happening even from their own, their own nation. As the scriptures just said, they're divided. Um... And uh, as Psalms chapter 64, verse 8 says, it says, So they shall make their own tongue to fall upon themselves. All that see them shall flee away. Yes. Right now, everything that they have put out, all this information that they have put out, and you have Edomites even saying it. Because for some reason, Amalek thinks that he's, he, that he's uh, done and void. When it comes to, to uh, biblical prophecy and them being Edomites, the so-called Jews of today are definitely Edomites. If you're not from the bloodline of 
Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, you are not a child of, you're not, from, you're, not a, you're not a part of the children of Israel. As the scriptures say, there's a bastard from Ashdod, Salakia. These are bastards trying to proclaim our heritage and have stolen it and given us bywords and other sorts of names to describe or to um, explain who we are in this world today in which they have hidden themselves for uh, a very long time. But like the scriptures say, in that time, the man of sin be revealed. That is Esau Edom, and we know that. But um, I just want to regurgitate this and keep on pushing it because um, Esau's in the hot seat and they're being exposed. And you got rabbis, so-called Jews, exposing themselves as if they don't, they're not a part of the nation of Edom, in which they are. And so, uh, Lord willing, you were continue to be edified with this uh, quick um, response to the elders' video. Uh, Shalom. Until next, until again, Shalom. Y'all by Shemel Vashai, by Shemel Krakadash, Barakatham. Shalom.